Hey guys, welcome to Little Tuesday. I'm David Azuk, and today I'm with my boy Slim Avis from Movement Hackers. And today we're learning how to move. What are we doing today? So today we're gonna learn how to move better. We're gonna learn about like the shoulder joint okay. and how it is fundamental in uh, the mechanic of a punch. So keeping your shoulder loose, having a strong scapular connection will make your punch better. We are very complex movers, so we need this um, constantly being challenged, learning new patterns, learning new movement. And this translates very well in fighting. Fighters like McGregor, Michael Venom Page, Vasily Lomachenko, they are creative because they know all of these little mechanics. So this is like to expand your reach. Instead of just punching like this, you punch like this, you extend this. You see? Blocks you, you gain at least 10 centimeters reach, man. Imagine you just control like everything is relaxed and straight. You just want to move the shoulder forward, that's it. See? You should, you should feel if you're turning or not. You should not be turning. Just the shoulder, you see what I mean? It's yeah. really isolated movement. So this Just the shoulder. Good. Bend your, your back, like stay relaxed. Yeah. Okay. This is the position. Yeah. Here you go, you see this? This is, the, this is what you gain. It's something very simple. is like doing a circle with your arm. But like, you know, I focus. I try literally to, 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 to expand my circle as far as I can. So instead of just doing this, I force it. You see, as far as I can each time. Cheers. Yes. Yes. I, I, I push it forward. Push, I push down, push behind, push up, push everywhere. I try to like... Not move too much. Yeah, not move too much. Just the shoulder. Okay. Boom. Oh, yeah. Feels yeah. good. You hear it? I feel it, yeah. You see? And it feels like it's everything's stretching. Yeah. Man, the shoulder is so mobile. So you should like expand everything. And then you add a bit more speed. Okay. And you just let your arm go. Roll. Okay. Keep a steady breathing. And you let it go. And each time you see, you should feel like blood rush in your yeah, fingers, it's right? It's very warm. This is very it's good. It's very man. warm in my head right now. Very good. good. Oh, wow. Yeah, it's man. Good. And this is like quality. This after that, your shoulder is very loose. So what you can add after that? So very simple, like the rubber band. Yeah. Bend your body like this. Yeah. Back straight. And actually here, I will just rotate my spine. You see? This is the movement that I do. Okay. And then I let my arm flow. Okay. You saw that with McGregor, right? Yeah. yeah. You see, I'm not leading with my arm. People do this with their arms. Yeah. But I'm leading, I'm just rotating my spine and I let the shoulders just fall. So when I do slow, it's like this. And the more speed I add, you see, it's just rotation so here. This is for shoulders? This is for shoulders. shoulders. Yeah, because like you want them to be able like to snap without injury. That's why uh, you can literally throw it as far as you can. And bring it back, and it's never. So this movement was actually—it's not a joke. It was not. No, stupid. it's a real thing. It's a real thing. Yeah, man. Okay. It's a real thing. Like for example, if you're a fighter, you're gonna build a body that is meant for fighting, right? Your back okay. is gonna be stiff. Your shoulders gonna be forward, and you're gonna stay like this, right? But there is a life after fighting, right? You have this body until you get old, and you have only one, right? So here we rehabilitate people's body, try to expand every 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 component, joint, muscle. Uh, we learn about like kinetic chains of movement. You see, if I punch, mm -hmm. this is all the joints that I snap yeah. in the shoulder. For example, in the mechanic of a punch, it goes yeah. from the toes, ankle, knee, hip, rotator, shoulder, elbow, wrist. A lot of joints. Yeah, yeah. So people who do that without working on each individual joint, they can't be like good puncher, right? Yeah, like yeah. there's a difference between doing this and doing when you like rotate everything and you can mm -hmm. throw it without fear yeah. because everything is connected everything is, is loose and everything is good imagine there are two walls one in front of you and one behind you right okay so what i want is draw a circle one in front of me like this without touching like the imaginary wall oh, okay when i reach here i draw the same circle behind me oh okay right and so you see in order to do that i have to rotate i just do this and i let it go you see i i put the weight on my right yeah, yeah. leg this doesn't move and i just rotate this one like this when you reach, you rotate here, behind, and back forward. Excellent. Try slow first and then add yeah. some speed. Excellent. Feel comfortable having the weight on one leg one and just leg. rotate. Okay. Like yeah. Excellent. It's, it feels weird, but it's, I like it. Yeah, and extend your shoulder, extend as far Same as, you as can. the other Same one. Same as the other okay. one. Man, people do this. Pa, pa. Yeah. There is no rotation. If I do this, boom. Boom. Mm -hmm. You see, like. That's the, the recoil. So it's all with the shoulder mobility. Always the that. shoulder mobility. Your favorite shoulder mobility one is uh, like the wall? Yeah, man, the two walls okay. is a great one. Okay. 
And it also it works on, on the balance, okay. on both arms. Okay. So it's a very simple.